All right, I tell you, we're, we're scrambling, as you might would guess, with a short week, um, trying to get ready for Thursday's game. We leave on Wednesday, so we, we've got our uh, a big practice today, which is normally the player's day off. And so, obviously, we're, we're trying to uh, get caught up and stay on schedule the best we can with this short week. Uh, real, real quick, uh, you know, not much else to say about this past week's game other than, you know, we just uh, we're in all these games every week. But we're not finding ways to win these games defensively. Once again, we we shut out a team or in the second half, I think, for the third straight week, if I'm not mistaken, um, without giving up a touchdown uh, for the third straight week. So we're making really good halftime adjustments defensively. Kicking game wise, our punt team is pinning people back deep. We're number one in kick off, uh, punt and kickoff units are covering uh, the best they've ever done and we're, we're doing a lot of good things. It's just the same thing we talked about last week. We're settling for all these field goals, not scoring touchdowns. You know, we get down the red zone twice and we had to settle for field goals. If we'd have got both those touchdowns, it's, you're talking about a whole different ball game, 14 points instead of six. And so it um, might even be a different, different outcome. So we've got to find some answers offensively. We're struggling with that because each week it seems to be something else, whether it's uh, uh, the offensive line, you know, struggled, I thought, a little bit the other night versus their front. I thought their front was a quality defensive line and did a nice job, and we didn't get a lot of push, and they got pressure and sacks on us uh, and kept, kept A.J. uncomfortable most, most of the night. Not having Elijah, obviously, uh, is a blow when he's not himself, and he's trying to give us all he's got. He just, you know, that wheel right now is just not turning like he would like for it to do. Um, but hopefully we'll get a little shot in the arm with Jamarcus Bradley back. You know, just we, we're playing musical chairs with guys coming in and out of the lineups each week, and that in some ways is affecting our consistency and uh, continuity on the offensive side of the ball. But uh, nevertheless, we've got to create some ways to give our guys a chance to, to make some plays, especially offensively. Uh, our, our inside linebackers defensively are – playing as well as you could play right now. They both uh, are making a lot of tackles and, and just giving us opportunities to, to, to win these games. The only, if there's one thing I wish the defense could improve upon them, and they're, they're working every day because I, I see it, I'm there, I watch it, is you know, if we could have got one turnover of the night, that might have been the difference in the game. You get two turnovers, we probably win the game. Uh, we're, we're doing a great job of taking care of the football. We're probably one of the top five teams in the nation with fewer turnovers. Um, we're doing a great job of that, but we're not getting any. And that's how you win the turnover battles. You don't turn it over and you, you like to get a few, but that's not happening. So we need to create some more turnovers, but that's definitely something we work on every, every day. But, you know, disappointing for our players because we're playing so well in so many areas, but that one big area of scoring points is, is a pretty big area and we're just not getting it done there yet. And so hopefully, uh, you know, with continued work and, and uh, trying to find some answers, we can eventually do that. But uh, um, each week we were, we're battling with these each, with every opponent. We're in the games and with chances to win the game, especially when your defense is pitching second half shutouts. And so we've got to find some ways to do that. So moving forward, hopefully uh, we can have a great plan for this week. Short week, but hopefully we can uh, to find some answers. So any questions? Well, a little bit maybe because we've seen something similar to that. Yeah, but it's been so long ago. You'd like for it to have been last week, you know. But, uh, you know, they'll, they'll be able to maybe draw a little bit off of, of that game. Uh, but, you know, it's totally different. You know, our game plan will be totally different this week than it was against Tulane. But um, we've seen something a little bit similar to, to that. But, but um, as far as a short week, that's just we're, we're pretty used to those. Yeah, it makes it, it, it's hard enough to prepare for the option. It makes it even more difficult on a short week, that's for sure. So that, that's, that's tough. Going to play. Yeah, oh, he's going to play and uh, he's available. And um, he didn't do much last night, just trying to rest him up as much as we can. He'll go today. Um, so we'll see how, see, how, see how he moves around, but uh, he, he'll, he'll go and he'll play. Well, you know, we don't know much about them because we never played them, but, you know, obviously you know about their program, and they've got an outstanding program, a lot of tradition uh, there at their program. And so they've, they've been doing this for a long time. They're winning a lot of games, and I know they're not off to the start that they would like, but, 
but they've got an outstanding team and they've played some people really tough and uh, beyond the fact they, they were up on Ole Miss you know for the whole first half I think last week so they, they've got an outstanding team. A little bit, yeah, a little bit different. Not not a whole lot because you know you're not changing systems. You just you're just changing who's calling the plays for the most part, and so uh, not not a whole lot. But you know we we understand is is somebody different, new 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 philosophy on maybe when he's going to run, when he's going to throw, those type of things. But the plays are for the most part the the same. Well, one, you know. We, we've got to be able to throw the football and create some bigger plays. We're not getting any big plays. Uh, up until this past week, we had ran the ball really good. And this past week, we did not have a lot of success running the football. Give them credit. Uh, they were big up front and got after us. Uh, and But we, when, when teams are doing that, boy, you like to be able to create some big plays. And we're not getting enough big plays offensively. And um, those, are, those are critical. And so... Um, Moving forward, that that'll be important. Well, short week probably not is realistic, but you know that that uh, I wouldn't ever rule that out. Not for the fact that I'm disappointed with Anthony at all, um, but you know maybe down the line trying to give Jordan some playing time. Just maybe see if he could spark us a little bit and to get him a little, maybe a little play in time also. Not saying we're going to do that, not saying that uh, we're, we're not. So don't take it that we're, we're, we're not. I'm very happy with Anthony is taking care of the ball, managing the game. We didn't protect him very good the other night, and he's running for his life. Uh, but I would like to get Jordan into the game. Yeah, it, it, it's short week. You know, short week is hard, hard, hard to do. Anything? Yeah, Tulane. Yeah, he, it's it's been nagging since he has not you know been himself since since the first half of Tulane and uh, and like they said the guy man he wants to go and that that just will just won't go for him and uh, but he's fighting through it and so he's a he's a warrior. For as not playing him yeah. when it gets to the to the point where we don't think it's safe, you know what I'm saying? Right now, there's a difference between playing hurt and playing injured, you know what I'm saying? And so he's not playing injured, he's just sort of playing banged up. But if he ever gets to the point where we think he's ever could hurt himself, we would never do that. And then it's always his call too. You know, we ask him, hey man, how do you, how do you feel? You feel you ready to go, do you want to give it a shot? And if he ever tells us that, coach, I don't know, then if, I, if he says, I don't know, that means a no, you know? so. Uh, we always we always are uh, working with him, getting his thoughts on it, because we don't want to put him in any position to hurt himself. But he also wants to help his, help his team too, and he's not the only one playing banged up this late in the season. Everybody in the country has got players banged up on both sides of the ball, and so that's that's a part of football. Warriors Warriors play when they're a little banged up, and um, great players, and so. Um, and we got, he's not the only one. We've got a bunch of them, Jamarcus Bradley and Keenan Barnes, and uh, uh, the list goes on and on. So I can't just say he's the only one. Uh, they're all just as important in, in, in my eyes. Any other questions? Good? All right, thanks a lot. Appreciate it.